the innocence tarot we're going to do another divine masculine update we're going to use thoughtful behaviors once i finish shuffling i will turn down the music let's do this music do it well okay make sure you guys push that like button and subscribe okay it will really help me i would really appreciate it it'll take you nothing but a minute to like Boop. okay bless you from my heart to yours you guys know that i adore you love you guys so much and thank 
I want to thank everybody, you know, again for being there for me and my family and being able to give me that extra strength, you know, and compassion and love that only my family, my emphasis, my divine feminists can do. I love you guys tremendously. And yeah, I just love you guys. And I just want to thank all of you guys again. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. And yeah, we're about to get into this reading, but I still need you to push that like button. <laughs> okay. Don't forget. All right, so let's get into this reading, because what I see here on the board, mm, 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 it ain't no joke, okay? So Divine Masculine, okay, he over there with this karmic, okay? Him and this karmic, I guess, lived together, had a place together, okay? And this karmic, okay, Divine Masculine always argued. It was always something going on, okay? Divine Masculine and this karmic is always getting into it, okay? It looked like Divine Masculine, okay, and this karmic, okay, have been arguing recently, okay? They've been arguing like cats and dogs recently because they both teamed up against your Divine Feminine, okay? Both of this karmic and divine masculine, okay, have both been sitting up here doing spell work on you. If you was wondering if your divine masculine and this karmic is doing spell work, okay, your intuition already told you that something was up. God already been giving you the downloads, okay, about what's been going on. And God has told you, okay, some type of way through intuition through dream god has told you that this mask you already knew that the karmic was doing magic on you but you wanted to know is my masculine doing magic on me as well yeah your masculine got mad at you because you walked away you didn't want to fight for him run chase him you an empress you don't chase nobody you replace okay and he got mad about it and Divine Masculine teamed up with this karmic, okay, and starts sitting up here doing magic on you, okay? Doing magic on you, Divine Feminine, for no fucking reason, okay? All because this karmic, okay, was sitting up here jealous of you, okay? She was jealous of you, and she wanted to hurt you in every way. So Divine Masculine starts sitting up here doing spell work. He starts sitting up here, okay, giving into his shadow side, and he's very upset, okay, about how he went about it. Your divine masculine wanted you to pay, just like this karmic. They wanted you to pay. This karmic was jealous, obsessed with you, and the masculine was pissed off that you didn't chase him and that you wasn't willing to be in no toxic-ass bullshit behind him. And they began to plot against you, worked against you, divine feminine, okay? And got to plotting and wanting to hurt you, divine feminine. As I said, they wanted your head on a platter, divine feminine, okay? Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. They did divine feminine. Where did it go? Okay. Divine masculine in super regret, okay, for sitting up here dealing with others and this karmic on doing magic against you, okay? Divine masculine is pissed off. He's hurt because everything that they were sitting up here doing magic, death spells, health spells, trying to block your finances, all the shit and the fucking spell work has went back to this masculine. Everything that they did to you is coming back to them. Divine Masculine was doing the fucking most, okay? He wanted your head on the platter because you wasn't with the bullshit, okay? This karmic began to bully this masculine, began to tell this masculine, okay, if you don't want this bitch no more, you will sit up here and do spell work on her. If she did this, she did that. See, your masculine talked a lot of shit. He went talking a gang of shit to these karmics about you that was fucking lies, okay? And this karmic wanted him to prove. She wanted him to prove his loyalty. And they began to sit up here and do spell work on you, okay? They did. This masculine and this karmic will do spell work on lots of different people over the years, okay? But he's in full regret for sitting up here listening to this crazy-ass bitch, okay? And doing spell work on you because something is going on with Divine Masculine's health or the karmics or someone in their family, okay? Divine Masculine and this karmic 
all the spell work is going back to them and their family, okay? And they sitting up here in super fear. Divine Master wishing that he didn't sit up here and come for you, okay? Divine Master wants you to know that he had got caught. Divine Masculine wants you to know that he was not keeping it real in the beginning. Divine Masculine was in a relationship with this karmic and got caught, okay? And he and this karmic got to sitting up here manipulating him, okay? Crying, sitting up here acting a fool, sitting up here playing the victim, okay? And um, her and this Masculine start doing fucking spell work on you, okay? Divine Master, let this karmic point all the fingers and say it was him. And if he loved her, he would do this, he would do that. And Divine Master did it, okay? It's the truth, okay? Divine Master didn't know, he said. He said that he didn't know what to do when he got caught up by the karmic because his karmic was pointing fingers. She was sitting up here acting a fool. She was crying. She was upset. She was telling anybody that would sit up here and listen that Divine Masculine had did her dirty, that he was out here cheating on her and all type of shit, okay? And Divine Masculine went along with this bullshit, okay? And this is when they begin to plot. One, your head on the platter, doing death spells, doing all type of rituals on you, okay? And Divine Masculine went for it, okay? They, they was always sitting up here bumping heads. All they did was argue, okay? 24-7, okay? That's why it's hard for you to believe that he even likes this karmic, okay? This karmic. Divine Master said bullied him into doing spell work on you, okay? That's what Divine Master said up here. It says allegedly, okay? This karmic was walking around, pouting, okay? Ready to sit up here and start drama. She continued to argue with this masculine each and every day. Study point now, he won this, he did that, that she wore on him to the point that he agreed okay, to do magic on you. See, at first, Divine Master, he was trying to fight against it. He was like, nah, I'm not going to sit up here and do that to Divine Feminine, but when you didn't, but when you didn't chase him, Divine Feminine, when you didn't sit up here and do the things that he wanted you to do, see, this Master wanted you to cheat him, um, chase him. You stopped. When he chose that crime, you sat up here and you went on to start working on yourself, and Divine Master justified it, okay? He justified his actions on sitting up here working with this karmic, okay, and doing magic on you. He justified it, okay? This karmic and him argue each and every day, okay? This karmic felt some type of way that the masculine was really thinking about walking away, okay? She wouldn't just let it go. She loved starting drama each and every day. She brought this shit up each and every day. She was walking around, pouting, showing her ass. Every time he talked to her, they was arguing on Skype, on the phone, and everything, okay? Divine Masculine was sitting up here feeling as though he had something to prove, okay? Told you, this karmic stayed on Skype. She wanted to know where he was, what he was doing, why he wasn't answering the phone, all type of different shit, okay? And Divine Master started working with this drama queen. She stayed on his ass bringing up this situation that he wanted to leave, okay? She bullied him. She talked shit. She brought other people in the mix as well, okay? She did, okay? She did. This karmic was so angry, so mad, okay? When she sat up here and found out about you, Okay, that she cried, acted a fool. She was so pissed. She was so angry, Divine Feminine, okay? When she was able to discover your light to be able to come across the Empress, okay? She wasn't liking that shit, okay? And she felt some type of way. She started, she, whoever this karmic is, she knows exactly what to do, what to say to break this masculine, Okay? She know how to get up under his skin. She know how to fuck with him, to trigger him. And she pulled everything in the book, okay, when she found out that 
this masculine was dealing with you, okay? She couldn't believe it. She was so mad. So she wanted to sit up here and start trauma, okay? She was bullying this man, and she wanted your head on a fucking platter, divine family. She hates your fucking guts, okay? She expressed that each and every day on Skype, on phone, okay? This karmic and divine masculine, okay? Every time they got high off drugs or drunk liquor, that's when things were more intensified, okay? And Divine Masculine was under the influence of Divine Masculine agreed to sit up here and work with this karmic to prove his love to her and begin to do spell work on you. He did. Whoever this karmic is, she is a bougie ass, materialistic ass female, okay? She care about labels, she care about clout, she care about everything that don't mean shit, okay? And she likes that lifestyle, okay? And that's her, okay? But she likes that lifestyle and she was pissed off, okay? And felt as though you was a threat and you could care less about that shit, okay? Whoever this karmic is, she's an energy vampire just like your divine masculine. And she began to sit up here and and bully him into submission and he agreed to sit up here okay and um go against you he okay he did he he wanted to prove something to her okay that he cared okay this karmic kept coming to him also what we gonna do if you love me you'll do this if you love me you'll stop talking to him if you love me you'll do this and he went for it and let's not forget your divine master under the influence okay and he going for the okie doke, okay? And she knew exactly how to play it. She was crying. She was upset. She was on the phone. She was telling other people about the fine master did this and did that to her. She continued to point them fingers. And she was upset finding out that he was cheating, okay? And she began to make his life a living hell, okay? This karmic was on and she wanted revenge. She thought each and every day on how she can hurt you, how she can break this um this connection, okay, apart. And she plotted, she planned, and she did, okay. She wanted to sit up here and hurt you, and she wanted to sit up here and wanted to get revenge against the masculine. This could be someone he lives with, a baby mother, a wife, or all three of the above, okay? But she wanted revenge, and she wanted Divine Master to show her, to show you that she won, but you could care less, okay? When Divine Master went over there with that karma, you stop dealing with everything, you start healing, and you start working on yourself. This karma she really thought that she was doing something, blocking the connection, stopping and interfering with what God wanted, okay? But you don't want no man that's easily to be taken, okay? And your divine master definitely can be with you being indecisive, not knowing what he was doing, okay? You're grateful that God has stopped that, okay? You're grateful that he went over there and picked a weaker person to be able to do the bullshit with, okay? Because you wasn't going to accept it, but... This is who cock blocked. This is why your divine master stopped talking to you. This is why he ghosted you because this karmic wanted to make a point, okay? That, that um, divine masculine was hers, okay? So I told you, she plotted this for a minute before she did this, and she did a lot of magic to make sure that this masculine uh, um, complied, okay? Him and her was doing magic, and she was doing magic on him, okay? For real. This karmic wanted whatever you and him had going on to stop, okay? And she got to do a spell work, okay, and going to people to stop it, Okay? Whoever this karmic was, she was very suspicious, okay? And she began to look. She began to watch everything, okay? And she found out that the masculine was talking to you, okay? She did. She was very suspicious, okay? Mm -hmm. And she started setting up, yep, she was jumping to conclusions. She was very suspicious if the masculine was out here fucking around, okay? And divine masculine, okay? got caught up in a lie, which you didn't know nothing about divine feminine, okay? And this karmic wanted fucking revenge. 
she wanted revenge and she wanted the relationship to stop. And she did. Okay? And Divine Master went along with it. Okay? Mm-hmm. Your Divine Master has cheated on his karmic so many times with so many bodies. Okay, and this karmic, every time this masculine cheats on her and everything, she gets to doing spell work on these other lovers, okay, doing evil things to be able to separate the masculine away from other options. But it, none of the magic is working on you, and she's feeling some type of way. It'll work on so many other people until you came along, Divine Feminine, okay? And she's not knowing which direction to go with this bullshit, okay? She don't know what to do, okay? And her evil side is coming out each more and more each and every day because she's not used to not sitting up here pointing a finger at Divine Masculine starting shit. Okay, they done done this to so many fucking people. It's ridiculous. Okay, it's ridiculous. Divine Master doing all this bullshit for this karmic. When this karmic out here sitting up here having threesomes, she in other relationships, she done had abortions, she been doing all type of shit other than the masculine. Okay, all up in his face. She keep him sedate sedated with magic and she does really what she wants to fucking do she got the best of both worlds okay she feels okay but god said enough okay this karmic is willing to sit up here and do anything for clout okay like i told you this karmic okay has got so much revenge on so many different people where is it? Okay, she done got did so much magic on so many people. You wouldn't believe a lot of some people done died. I think some people done died. Okay, she done done so much magic on people. Okay, and she done got away with doing this shit so long that now karma is here. Karma is here. Okay, because this karma wouldn't stop. She wouldn't stop doing what she's doing. Okay. And Divine Master continued to be two-faced as she was being two-faced too, okay? For real. Divine Master is karmic and sitting up here trying to hack you, okay? She's trying to find out all type of different information, where you live, who you are. She wants to know everything about you. And she's on Divine Master about giving her that information, okay? She's sitting up here pointing the fingers, and she's sitting up here, really sitting up here, trying her best to get up under Divine Masculine's skin so he can break, so he can put you in a situation. They already were doing death spells. They already were sitting up here doing magic on you, and she, she is mad, and she is upset that all this magic is coming back to them, okay? And she's blaming the Masculine. She's blaming the masculine, and she's crying, too, because that magic is went back. Whoever this is, this is somebody for somebody precisely, okay? Whoever they've been doing magic on you, okay? They have, yes, they did a lot of magic on you, and Divine Masculine went for that shit. He was doing shit. God said, do you hear me? Okay, for real. And God done sat up here and shown you, okay, the truth. They was doing magic. Your divine masculine is so fake. He's so weak. He go along with the ulti dope. And anytime anybody puts some pressure on him, he did this shit to you, divine feminine. And he's wrong. And all this shit is going back to him, okay? Whoever this karmic is, okay, she did a lot of lying on you to sit up here and make this masculine think that he couldn't trust you, okay? When she was the main person studying, getting caught up, Said he used the sex as a as a weapon. This karmic slept around, did what she wanted. She was studying cheating on the masculine, and then had the nerve to get mad when the masculine would cheat on her. This shit was some sick ass bullshit. And this karmic does nothing but lie, and she keeps up a lot of bullshit. She never admits to the shit that she does. Okay, and this bitch likes to kick up drama. She loves to kick up drama. Okay, and this is why. Divine Master stopped sitting up here dealing with you, okay? It's because she was doing magic, okay, to stop him from calling you, dealing with you, doing shut-up spells, all type of shit. This bitch did the works on him, okay? And Divine Master, he was a fool for going against you, listening to this bitch, because whatever they did has went back, okay, to they 
seeing everything happening to them. Their health is decreasing. Their money is decreasing. Every spell that they did on you has returned back to sender. And then they, then they sick fighting through it all, okay? It's a lot of shit going on behind the scenes, all because this karmic wanted to show her ass. Now she over there scared, upset, seeing that everything that she was doing is coming back. Instead of just leaving you the fuck alone, they wanted to come for you, divine feminine, okay? Instead of going on about their business, okay? They did that. Divine masculine did that shit to you, okay? He got the working with his karmic to try to stop you, okay? That's cold as a motherfucker, but he did do that, okay? And if you was wondering, yes, his ass turned dark. Yes, his ass don't give a fuck. Yes, his ass was working with more than two to three other people on trying to take you out, okay? Your life, okay? Your shine and everything that God was blessing you, trying to stop your abundance, your divine master turned dark, okay? Them entities took over. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, that's what the 411 is. I think I will just leave it right there. Do I still have that time? I think I'm still that time. Okay, yeah, whoever this karmic is, she's a big manipulator. This bitch is always sitting up here putting her hands on the mask man to make him go along with wrong shit. Divine mask man picked up so much karma on dealing with this bad look ass bitch, okay? This karma is coming back heavy, and Divine Masculine know it, too. He know it, too. They over there arguing. She over there crying. They both over there seeing that all the magic that they did on you has returned back to sender. The drugs and the drinking don't even make the masculine and her even feel good, okay? They so shook, okay? All because this bitch was mad because you was winning. All because this bitch couldn't stay in her lane, okay? Now look, okay, was it worth it? Okay, no, it wasn't, okay, yep. And whoever this karmic is, she done stole a lot of shit from the masculine, okay? She don't care, she just want a big payout, okay? She don't give a fuck, okay? Divine Master gonna end up seeing something that he ain't gonna believe, okay? And what he might end up seeing is that the person that he trusted, the person that he was working with, is the main person that they never give a fuck about him, okay? And Divine Master needs to stop running from the truth and face it all. The Divine Master needs to face that you can't just make sexual connections into no divine being connection, okay? He studied trying to look for you within everybody, but he would never be able to find that again, okay? Divine Master was so stupid for dealing with this thirsty-ass bitch and don't give a fuck about him, okay? And God is putting it all to a stop, okay? She was too happy to hurt you, Divine Feminine. She was too happy to sit up here and start drama and make your Divine Master turn up, turn on you with black magic and spell work. He a grown-ass man. He made up his own mind, but you don't even know this bitch. Why is she so obsessed? This shit is crazy. This bitch is so mad that she could care less. Like, what is she mad about? I don't get it, okay? Yeah. She hates that you sitting up here winning and this bitch continues to do spell work on you. Why? Because she is a success hater. And you like, girl, bye. You ain't got time to be on that bullshit, okay? Yeah. She got real threatening behaviors, okay? She is something else. Their relationship is not strong. It's always pull tug, okay? They don't get along. No chemistry, okay? And Divine Master had the nerve to leave you hurt behind that bitch. Mm -mm. This karmic was plotting. She wanted to call you. She wanted to sit up here and get some unnecessary shit started, okay? She wanted to call you with some lies, okay? So don't fall for the bullshit. She wanted to talk to you, hear your voice so bad. So bad, okay, for real, more than a man, okay, yes, and Divine Master is starting to see right through it, okay, this karmic is sitting up here study keeping Divine Master on spell work, study keeping him doped up, okay, 
doing everything in son to keep him with spell work so him and you do not come together so you and him did not sit up here and come within you she did this on purpose to be able to stop but she didn't do nothing but delay it okay your divine master had it bad about those two people doing foul ass shit, okay yeah Whoever this karmic is, she very aggressive, she very angry, she very triggered. She could have been sitting up here sending you messages from apps, okay? All these karmics is. I, I even didn't experience, I don't even answer that shit. Like, what the fuck? You gotta pay me to be. I ain't got time to be answering these hoes. But yeah, the bitch been one the fuck with you do, you know, emails, through text messages, through apps, all type of shit, okay? Mad because she know that the vine master want to stalk you, watch you, knowing that he'd rather be there with you. And it pisses her ass off. Oh, it makes her mad. Whew. The divine feminine, you done stopped all that shit, okay? Mm -mm. God done told you to back up, and you did back up. You ain't, mm -mm. That was enough for you. You just want to heal, okay? The divine master want to be over there. Okay, with the bougie queen, hey, that's what he want to do. That's what he want to do. He want to be over there playing and talk too crazy and never love because she don't care. She, He better be there with that money. He better be there to buy her new shoes and purses and everything. And Divine Masculine has been so catered to doing it, okay, to this karmic that got comfortable with mistreating him. And she's so mad that no matter how much spell work, that she does on this mask, but he still stocking, he still wants you, and she can't remove that love. You are the first lady. She's so mad, and she hates this twin flame journey. She hates it. She hates the fact that she is the karma. She really do. She's so angry. She's so pissed. She don't know what to do because she's a power hungry ass bitch. Okay, and let's not forget. They both going through health problems, people and their families going through different things as well because they continue to do the spell work. And the spell work has returned back to Cinder. It has. And Divine Master has fucked his whole life up for a piece of ass. And this bitch is out here cheating on him with everybody. And he out here cheating too. So, yeah, that's what the 411 is, you guys. And, um... Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it right there. Shit, I gotta go get me some of that cold water, okay? But yeah, I'll talk to you guys. I love you. Bye.